Let's go. Let's go. Steam's giving them away for free. We're getting free games out here. Let's go. Let's go. Let's get some free games. Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. Free games. Hey, we're going to be checking out a curated collection of games. A hundred plus games. Awesome. Hey, so... I honestly don't know where this came from, but I could probably take a good guess, right? It's, uh, you can get a bunch of free Steam games, right? Like, my brother installed way too many games on my PC, Red. And this is how I got there. Too many games? Yeah. Okay, well... I can't, I can't really find what I was looking for, but there, there's a website that you can go to and use a plugin, and it will get you free games on Steam. It's a, literally like the most trusted Steam website, aside from Steam, but hey, if you don't trust that, that's fine. Maybe not, maybe, maybe I just got this at some point. I don't know. Look it up. It's free. It's free, baby. It's freaking free. All of it's free. I like fucking turn on the faucet, put my hands under it, and what flows is free games out of my hands. Why do I see this? Noob question, just have, having too many games installed mess with your PC. Planet Tide 2, Vermin Tide 2, Valheim, etc. I'm like, I'm expecting like another few games that just have the number 2 at the end of them. Alright, well... We're checking out a buttload of free games. And you know what that means? There's a lot of them. There's a lot of games, dude. I played this for one minute just to see if it worked. It does. I figured that it would work, but, I, you know, who knows? So sometimes you start up these Unity games, quote unquote. And yeah. Oh, God. You love that? Just like in the middle of this? Whatever this is? Kind of popping though. Wait, 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 I didn't expect it to save the last location I was on. <coughs> Excuse me. God. It's like literally every time I eat, almost any time I drink like something that's not water, or like, you know, soda or whatever. Ah. Oh. Okay, let's go back to the very beginning. To the very beginning. I don't know if I want to do this sequentially. Yo. What? Yeah, I keep the music on. Launcher credits. Wait, we we're only giving credits for the launcher? Uh, okay. Well, I guess everybody has their own credits here. Can I, like, make the window smaller, please? No. No. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> 
He's going crazy Dave, dude. He's going fucking crazy Dave mode. He's going fucking crazy Dave mode. I guarantee you. This will probably just open a new window, but okay. Like, uh, sure, sure, sure. Let's do 10 second painter. By Sebastian Skyini. Sebastian Skyini. Just even like getting picked up, right? God, this is so huge, Lois. It's so huge, Lois. Okay. It. I knew it. I knew it would open a brand new window. God damn you. God damn you. I knew you would do this 10 second painter. What? How dare you? What? You what? I, I couldn't even capture that. I couldn't even capture any of that, first of all. Second of all, the game outputs two separate music tracks for Windows. I don't, I don't know why. Third of all, it, it just, oh, what? I, I couldn't even tell what was going on whenever it first opened at all. Bro, this is... This pack of games looks like torture. This pack of games already looks like torture. Where is it? Hey, 10 second painter. I've got 10 seconds. I, I, you can't even see the game. Oh, there it is, I guess. Yeah, is, is that, is it there? The, this thing looks like it was designed for like a Windows XP. Okay, give me one more second here. Uh, very nice. We have like extremely cool classical music. Is this Bach? Ah, yes. I'm quite fond of this tour. Okay, Sebastian. Quant? Okay. Biscuit. Uh, um, it's quite similar to this. It's uh, very smooth on the top, and it's kind of grainy texture, and it's smelly. It's very smelly. That's a biscuit. And it asks you to fucking save it. I don't know if I want to save the biscuit, but sure, biscuit. <laughs> okay, let's try another sup. Hey, we're doing like a hundred games. We're, we're doing way too many games right now. We're, we're doing more than a hundred games. It's just 10 second painter, but it's really cursed. Sebastian is very evil. Toilet paper, man. Why do you want me to draw this shit? I'm getting the extra, like, Duplo super ply, okay, Anya? <laughs> Why would I want to save this? I save it as P-E-P-I-R -E dot P-N-G. Yeah? <laughs> okay. Yeah, this is like the best Bren art you could ever witness. The music's very loud. I'm not surprised. Does this help? That probably helps a lot, right? It opens two instances of audio. Unless the program's open twice? No, it's not. It's not. I, I, I'm not open twice. I'm not. Fruit. Okay, I'm gonna draw a pear. Yeah, that's right. That's right. You give me green. Because I was gonna make a green apple, you thought. No, it's a pear. Get fricked. P-A-R-E dot P-N-G. Okay, I'm like now addicted to this. What the fuck? See, it's not as loud for me, but that, that's fine. Because I don't really care that much. A fan? Okay, dude, okay. I'm giving you like a fucking Japanese style one. Get bricked, guy. Fucking ornamental Japanese style fan. <coughs> How do I fuck this hard? Uh... <laughs> F-N-N-E <laughs> F-N-N-E That's how you spell fan in my world Okay, plush Oh my god Are you kidding me? I can't even do that fast enough But okay Like fucking has a hair thing And like 
fumo.png. Best pair. Now I feel like I'm just in Garthic fun, but it's like hyper instantiated. What did the pro turn the prompt off? Okay, you have to drag it. You have to drag the prompt. You can see my cursor, okay. Wow. Ten seconds it wait. Ten, ten, ten seconds to draw nothing? Ah. You see. But I circled the nothing. Single player Gartic phone. <laughs> Zero player Gartic phone. Zero player Gartic phone. Nobody's here. Turn the prompt back on. I, I want the prompts. Yes. Peach. Now look at that. Now that's a peach. You need like the fucking sprout and then. It's very smooth. P E C H E. Pach. Say single player Gartic phone. That's just so silly to me. That's so silly to me. Okay, one more. Let's do one more. All these stupid images. I, lo <laughs> I love that I get plush and I immediately draw like Cherno Fumo. <laughs> you need to give it an ass. A singing fish. Okay. I will give it an ass. Uh, and then it has like a fucking big badonka donk. <laughs> Shitting fish. <laughs> okay. Peach ass. Peach looking ass. All right, what's the next game? This is ridiculous. Do I have to open the entire co You reopen the entire collection. Very good. Credits to the launcher team on that one. <laughs> Credits to the fucking launcher team on that one. Holy shit. Which way? Which way? Which way? Which way? No, 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 no. What? Ah, uh, that's right, that's right, it hates his- the game hates its existence for some reason. God damn. Okay, 10 second toaster, all by, also by Sebastian. Also by Sebastian. No, no, you can't do this to me, Sebastian. Fuck. <laughs> you can't do this to me, Sebastian, no. You fricker. Now it's gonna be ultra loud, right? Dave Ultra Kill loud. Okay, well at least he fixed the audio this time. Oh. <laughs> Graphics quality ultra. <laughs> Why do I get to pick like a... <laughs> Why do you allow me to configure anything? Pyrotober collector. This is just a part of a different games pack, man. Sebastian killed my grandma. You hear that, Sebastian? Oh my god. Oh! <sighs> that was awful. Hey, man. You can't just be making, like, garbage out here. Sebastian, you can't just be making, like, garbage out here, man. Okay, I, no, I'm just, like, dabbing on the creators because, uh, it, it's hard to make, like, a game pack launcher. That makes sense. I'll probably just do this. There you go. Hey, Sebastian, can I make some toast? Oh, where is it? Where's the game? <laughs> wow, this is like the most technical difficulty stream pack I've seen. Okay. <laughs> it's like the very silly. Oh, those textures are fucking insane. I think this entire game is kind of insane. What is wrong with my like filters here? Nothing. <laughs> oh, okay, I see it like stretch the window, okay. Wait, to what? Okay. <laughs> I'm ultra confused. But I guess I got it to work. Technical difficulty PNG, yeah. <laughs> I have to make as much toast as I want? This is like Flash games. We just made Flash games all over again, but it's a Unity. Yeah? <laughs> okay, I guess I can make almost 69 toast in like, you know, 10 seconds. Can I make, can I make 69? Look at like how fucked my mouse is. Okay, I'm not even clicking that fast. Guess I wasn't paying attention? Yeah. 
I almost exactly got there. Okay, hold on. You ready? You ready? You ready? Fuck. Fuck. No, I'm gonna fuck it up, damn it. No. No. Okay, are you ready? Are you ready for the ultimate speed tap? You ready? This is my finger. This isn't even like a fucking robot doing this. Holy shit. 69, 80. Holy fuck. <laughs> I, I was vibrating my finger. I was vibrating my finger and I got 92 toes per 10 seconds. Holy fuck. What? <laughs> What does that metric mean? What, what does it mean that I can get 92 toasts in 10 seconds? That's 9.2 toasts a second. That's a lot of toasts. He's diabolical with toasts. Do I dare even try again? The finger spam technique is like something that only few can harness. And <clears throat> do you dare challenge me in like a Mario party and ask me to do this? I, I will cry and die and then win. I'll win, but I'll cry and die. Before and after winning. <laughs> I'll like come back the first time, but then I'll eternally die the second time, okay? Somebody stop him! He's making too much toast! You ready? I was like pre spamming the first time. Yes, the balance, the balance! Fuck. God damn it, I had it. But it, kept, it kept going downward. The downward spiral of the mouse while install an auto clicker for this shit. This ain't RuneScape. I'm way faster than an auto clicker. I'm way faster than what Java can pick up. RuneScape's fucked. Oh, 99. 99. <laughs> I I'm done here. I'm done here. I'm done here. I get 99 toasts in 10 seconds. I, I'm like fucking gaming, I guess. Holy shit, I'm sure somebody else out there has like a million toasts, right? There, there's probably an actual achievement to turn on the auto clicker, right? Oh no. That's, there's probably a, an achievement, an in-game achievement that says turn the auto clicker on and get like 1,095 per second. 99 toes, fuck! <laughs> we're only on the second game, man. We're, we're only on the second game. Okay. <laughs> Holy shit. Okay. Give it a second. It needs to, like, warm back up, right? Or is it this one? Okay. <laughs> the bottom one is for... No, I got it. I got it. Okay, never mind. I got it. 10 second toaster. I don't think so, Sebastian. Play air guitar using a guitar hero guitar. I don't, I don't, I, Sebastian, man. You think I'm crazy, man? You think I, you want, I, okay. I am crazy enough to play some like fucking air guitar. Huh? Yeah. Okay, now I can select a custom resolution. Thank you, Sebastian. It seems like maybe going sequentially was very helpful because throughout the years, it's taken him years to do the first two games. Now it's like 30 seconds. He's harnessed the power. Now he will let you play Guitar Hero for free. Is there a speedrun.com category for that? There are achievements in this, so I don't know. Maybe. Maybe I'm like number one on the leaderboard now. Should I sign up for this? Should, should I sign up for this? You rock. Thanks. Thanks. I know, I know, I get 99 toasts in 10 seconds. It would have been even more, but like my, my index finger hurts now. You rock. Thanks. Thanks. Do I like import music? You rock. You rock. <laughs> I think I need to insert a token. I, I need to insert a token, I believe. Okay. Very cool. I don't think I completely comprehend that one. I mean, I just got, I got an achievement for playing 10 Second Painter. 
And only 4.9 of all players, 4.9% of all players have gotten that. To be fair though, everybody sucks at getting achievements on Steam. Like you could probably get them and it just doesn't even synchronize. Always falling. Keep falling and don't touch the sides. Do we just keep going sequentially or do I dare just toss it up now? There is like a random button. So maybe that. Whoa, it's time for more game. Yes, he did harness the power. He did harness the power, but it's like incredibly confusing every time. Every time he harnesses the power now, but he's always doing something different with the power. Sebastian Man? Oh my god. <laughs> Sebastian Man? Sebastian Man? Your power is unlimited, but you keep choosing different ones. You keep choosing different powers, man. It doesn't exist. God damn it. These are some creative ass names. I don't know if that's sarcastic or not. Keep falling. Oh, this is fucking dope. I've been kind of looking for something like this. Hold on, Sebastian. Hold on. Hold on, you're cooking, man. I'm letting you cook. Holy fuck, man. Holy fuck, Sebastian. <laughs> you wanna fuck around, Sebastian? Oh my god, this is some super hexagon shit right here. You seeing this? You see oh my god, this, this makes me love physics. And usually I, like, hate physics. Because it, like, always messes with you, right? It's like you drop a spoon, and you're dead. You're dead inside. Yeah, look at that, look at that. They're fucking, like... Get the GTA 4 swings in here. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay. I'm seeing some Terry Kavanaugh here, man. Like, you know, Super Hexagon. Yeah. What the fuck? Isn't that Terry Kavanaugh? Super Hexagon. Nobody wants to list the name of the developer. No, nobody wants to list the name of the developer. Yeah, it's Terry Kavanaugh. Yo, I get like Super Hexagon vibes from this, and I got Super Hexagon for free. So like, hold up, hold up. Terry, is that you, man? Are you hiding behind Sebastian? Are you behind Sebastian on like the keyboard, my man? Sebastian needs to figure out his audio shit. I think like it's 99.99. Repeating 999 times. Percent of Unity developers need to figure out their audio and like video shit. Why we suck so bad at it still? I don't even make Unity games, but like I, I play enough of them to know that like, hey, we, we, really, we really fucking suck at this. Yo, yo, Sebastian, my man, you got like the element right here. I don't know what you're talking about with like other stuff. Maybe, maybe the first game. Maybe the first game's good. Ten Second Painter's kind of good. But you're kind of fucking around with it. It's Super Hexagon Guy. Pulls off Sco Sebastian Scooby Doo Mask. It's Super Hexagon Guy. <laughs> yeah. Like we found out who the culprit was, guys. <laughs> that's, uh, that's like Morty. Morty Shaggy as much as possible. That's Morty Shaggy. I think like revolutions and time in the air affect your score. I think it's like a multiplier of both. And it just gives you the whole number every time. This is making me dizzy. So this is probably the last one. I just beat my score too. So that's good. It's kind of like throwing a pillow in the air over and over again. If you get like, you know, too worked up though, it is going to start flying around the room. And then you run to go catch it, and then you're flinging it again because you're worked up. And you just caught it, and you're like excited. See, like it's picking up speed. <laughs> See what I'm talking about? Like I flung the fucking pillow all the way up into the air on accident. I'm like, oh my god, what did I just do? Oh fuck. Okay, I win. I win. <laughs> I, mean, yeah, I guess the only winning move is not to play. The only winning move is not to play. Okay, well, that was pretty cool. <laughs> I would have gotten away with hexagoning too if it wasn't for you meddling kids. <laughs> I would have gotten away with hexagoning too. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking shakes my fist in the air. Shakes my fist. I would have gotten away with hexagoning. Okay. 
An introduction to integral ecology. Okay. Carson Mackey, Josh Warren, Sebastian Skyani, Skyini. Hey, Sebastian and Wu Zhang. I have a hard time saying Sebastian. What the fuck? Ben versus anime. Take control of Ben in his fight against the evil forces of anime. Excuse me? <laughs> Brent W. Oh my god. Bird Bakery. Brain. Sebastian made a lot in this pack, to be fair. I was hoping it would be more distributed. Like you'd see early on who the other devs are. And this was where we were. Dark Roads. This game requires four players. Hey, uh, I get, I'm gonna need you guys to like hop into Discord really quick. <laughs> Let's go back. I actually want to keep going sequentially a little bit longer. Maybe like hit the randomizer button for a second. I genuinely read that as Bren versus anime. I keep hitting the fucking mic with my hat. What is this? We, we live, we, you just literally like, you're sitting in your, like, integral ecology class in college, or maybe you're just auditing it, I don't know. What is, is that what it's called? I forget. And you're just making this game. You're like, this is how I learn about this subject. Yeah? Is that what we did, Sebastian? Okay, but <laughs> no, we will have Bren versus anime. Watch, we will, man. We okay. Hey, hey, Sebastian, man. Hey, Sebastian, man, you fucked up again, dude. Hey, Sebastian, you fucked up hard. <laughs> what are you saying, man? I can't understand like the Animal Crossing speak. No, I don't want to buy, like, Red's Cursed fake painting. I need this. I need Bren versus anime. We had to do- we fucking had to do it to him. An introduction to integral ecology by Sebastian Skyini. Hello and welcome to an introduction to integral ecology. What is integral ecology? So what is integral ecology? Integral ecology is the application of integral theory to environmental philosophy and studies. So what is integral theory? You may be wondering. Well, I know all about that. Integral theory is centered around picking, choosing, and combining the philosophical ideas of other philosophies to make one ideal ph ph philosophy of your own. It works something like this. So, there are lots of philosophers, and they all have ideas, but they all believe that only their own ideas are correct, so then you show up and you happen to be an integral theorist. And you analyze, consider, and judge everyone's ideas, and then you remove the ideas that you don't like, and then take the ones you do. You may to make your own new idea that takes what is best from the ideas of those around you. <laughs> like I make it just sinister sounding. This is a far simplified version of how integral theory works. What brings us back to integral ecology? So what is integral ecology? It's an environmental philosophy that combines the ideals from many other environmental philosophies in order to create its own set of ideals. Integral ecology combines the ideals of the theoretical ecology postmodernity. And many other forms of environmental philosophies. Okay, we're like up on top of high rises, throwing Molotov cocktails full of like plant matter and like growing gorilla vines. Literally, literally, literally like vines, but we're like gorilla soldiers making vines. What? You're like, you're like up on the high rise planting stuff, but like it's not your high rise? Integral ecology is the belief that no single thing is entirely right or wrong, and everything is connected in some way. In integral ecology, everything from pollution to wealth distribution to environmental activism is related and studied. We're just- we're in Cruelty Squad. Now I'm sure this short presentation is all well and good, but why don't we step into the shoes of an integral theorist ourselves and try it out? Bro, I'm already there all the time. Use the arrow keys to move around! <laughs> You move close to an idea to push it to where you want it to go. Make the green good ideas go into the green dot bubble. The more you get in the row, the more points you'll receive. Be careful not to let the red bad ideas into the thought bubble, though. You don't want, like, the really sickening, like, awful red, horrible, awful, like, 
deep, horrifying, crippling, <laughs> destructive impulse. <laughs> Wait, what's the word I'm looking for? Like the, the <laughs> uncomfortable thoughts? Like, you know, whatever. Don't, don't, don't let the thoughts take over. <laughs> Be careful not to let the red bad ideas into the thought bubble, though. <laughs> doing so many times, doing so too many times will cause you to fail. This is this is me every single millisecond when I'm thinking. I have to go through a mini game to like parse my thoughts. That's all for how to play. Good luck and have fun. I'll see you again once you're done playing. I want to leave this purgatory. Put me in the mind zone. I want to escape. The bad ideas are already coming! I love these diagrams are in college. I know! It's exactly what I said. We just made like a fucking college note into a game. Man, <laughs> it's probably way easier to do it this way now too. Instead of like writing a fuckload of notes and going, what? What even made sense here? I don't remember. I don't remember why I even did any of that. Well, like, okay, this note makes sense, but like, I could just look that one up on Wikipedia. I think my teacher, my like proctor, my instructor looked that up on Wikipedia anyway. Okay. He did come in and just like slam down the thermos full of NyQuil and just like start eating flaming hot Cheetos and then pass out after sipping all the NyQuil, so. I mean, I guess class is over, but like, it's always over. We're just always sitting in here, like, chilling on our, our Nintendo 3DS. I, I don't know, like, what? Do they even pay this guy? Oh yeah, of course, why? Wait, wait, you, you guys don't pay for this class? Hold on, you're still getting your degree. You don't have scholarships or anything. You like, you don't even take loans or you're not paying for this class. You're still getting your degree? Hold on, I'm like $300,000 in debt. Hold, hold on, hold on. Hold on, I, 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 I'm like $300,000 in debt. <laughs> Sebastian has Newgrounds avatar. You literally just described me yesterday. NyQuil and sleep. I thought you were talking about like assignments. Like, like you know, the teacher is like, ah, I'm just fucked. I don't care. They don't even pay me anymore. All, all of it goes to like Kleenex. All my money goes to Kleenexes. Yeah. All the good thoughts. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> what is this bullshit, man? Put the red dot in. Yeah, put the red dots in. <laughs> this is very stupid for me to be this entertained by it. I'm not saying the game's stupid, it's like the concept of everything right now. It's stupid that I'm this entertained by this. Put the red dots in, yeah! Wait, I failed, but I didn't fail. Ding! Gotta put him in. Yeah. <laughs> Welcome back! Wow, you got a great score! I hope you learned something about integral theory and integral ecology today. Thanks for listening. You can always come back to try for a new high score anytime. Bye for now. So literally, bro, society. We live in a society. There are all of the notes. Here. No, it's scientific. There are all of the notes. Well, okay. We need to include the glyph in the documentation. Now it's scientific. It's a cited work now. <laughs> what the fuck? Perspectives in Social Theory, Nature, Knowledge, and Negation. November 26, 2009, 75 to 92. Yes, I, I remember reading that scientific paper once. What the fuck? We, we made a college like assignment that was just a video game. <laughs> you just say, don't let your anger get the best of you? All the red thoughts is the rage. See, I went way deeper. Or maybe like less deep. I think maybe I, I went superficially deep. You went deeper. I'm like this is this is a society. This is a society. So we just keep corralling all the good thoughts until we get like a bad actor who puts like all the red thoughts in there all at once. <laughs> I look at this. It says 10 second toaster in OBS, and I'm like, yeah, they put the toaster in the bath. <laughs> like the red thoughts actor put the toaster in the bath in the society. 
Asterismic blaster. Shoot asteroids to the beat. Okay. Okay. Yeah. I immediately lower the volume to like 20. <laughs> it actually opens at a pretty fair resolution. Fair enough, man. I run your game, you open at a fair resolution, man. Fair enough. Asterismic blaster. That sounds kind of like fake. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm supposed to dodge. Where's the beat, man? Evan Wright from Hotline Miami 2 with thought process right there. I wish I understood. Hold on. It actually has music, so let me turn it up a bit. Okay. What am I listening for? The rhythm? What rhythm? Is it, Am I listening to this? Am I literally listening to these? Okay, I see. I was like, what? Yeah. Let me know if the music's too loud, because uh, despite getting new, like, cheap headphones, because I just buy cheap ones, I always break them, no matter what type. On accident. Complete accident. Oh, yeah. Uh, despite that, like, my audio versus your audio is completely different. What is balanced for you is, like, completely quiet for me. And what's balanced for me is, like, your ears are exploding. So I'm convinced your ears are exploding right now. I almost lost. What? Huh? Oh, I see. I was like, what? It's a, it's a reference to the original Atari game, I see. The problem is, though, if you let go of the mouse, you just shoot anywhere. Okay, hold on. I hide. I hide. Okay, they still got me. That's great. They still managed to get me. Sounds good to you? Okay. Stab. Is there, like, a space bar? Can I do? Enter. W? Nope. It's all mouse controls. My best score was 19. I don't think I really want to play this. Yeah, I've immediately gotten my, past my high score. I mean, it's okay. If you like uh, Geometry Wars, it probably gets a little more difficult. So it's like not immediately overwhelming and you can actually hear the track. I think they made a mistake in making like such a slow to start song be the thing for this. Like you could've you could have just like cut the first seven seconds off of the opening of the track, right? Why not? I like it, I like it. It's just like uh, the build up's so slow it makes me think there's no music at first. Okay. Okay. I feel like I'm playing Newgrounds games for sure, so that's like an app thing you just said in the chat. I'm gonna see only Highline Miami 2 characters is, that does not kill, but he can if you want him to. Oh. I feel like at all times people are seeing spoilers, but it's like because I usually don't care. Most of the time if a chat member is posting a spoiler, it's because I can set to the spoiler. Most spoilers I don't want. I've already, like, prepared myself. You tell me an Elden Ring spoiler, I'm just gonna laugh. I don't even know what the fuck it means. I don't even know what it means. I don't even think this gets harder. I think it's just like a chill game. This might just be like a chill game experience. Alright, let's go to 100 million. Let's go to 100 million points. I was gonna say a million, but let's go to a hundred million. Yeah? I just open Cheat Engine and try and do that, but I, like, do I really want to? Hold on. <laughs> Will this work? Hold on. <laughs> Where is this? Asterismic Blaster. Yeah, sure. Uh, find value. For, okay, I'm looking for what now? It's like, uh, just zero, right? Okay, it's zero. Okay, I have zero. I'm looking for one now. 
Hold on, I need to I need to get one point. Damn it, I keep dying. <laughs> He's cheating! Spoiler comment, yeah. God damn it. Oh, it's so hard, it's so hard. I will cheat in this game. I will. Oh my god, I have to dodge while in cheat engine. This is impossible. <laughs> yes, I scanned again. I didn't find anything. <laughs> God damn it. Cheat engine, no, that's right, that's right. It is a Unity game. It's it's harder to find shit with Unity, I think. Or maybe it's way easier, I don't even remember. I just, it's one of the above, it's either harder or easier. Twitch ban him, he's hacking in a fucking offline game. Get him, get him. <laughs> that's right, they're gonna see me on like fucking Counter-Strike loading up cheat engine. To change my money from my side. I'm, I'm gonna just change it so I see a different number and then I won't be able to buy anything differently. Well, I will be able to buy things differently. I just won't be able to purchase more than my monetary amount. Balls with a Z. Let's hit the random button. Leave open. A bare bones competitive idol game. No. That's a lie. What? No, you can't see everything at once. An all new and expanded version of you can't see everything at once. Okay, this is multiple team. This is many people. We gotta look at this. Okay, I dropped the stream. Okay, I'm back. It's like only if I'm paying attention while I come back to Twitch. It's so fucking weird. And like, if I'm not staring at it, I'll just notice I've been offline for 10 minutes. And I'm like, what the fuck? Why? You want me to just go back into OBS and, like, scream that I'm offline? Like, what? Enter your name. I can't resize the window. Can I? You can't see everything at once, plus. Enter name. Brand smile. Sad fish, Brand smile. Brand smile. You can't see everything at once. Okay, plus, you can't see everything at once, plus. Does this look okay? Is this sound okay? Vroom vroom. The icon for this game looks like sus amogus. Th this is sus amogus icon for the game. Hope it sounds good. It seems like the audio is balanced fine, but. New game. X to shift. Oh boy. What? Shift? Like, shift realities. Am I, uh, like a goop man? Oh, I see. What? Can I jump? I can jump. Why? Okay, it just teaches you certain things? Okay, and you fall through a world sometimes? Or What? You can't, you can't see everything at once, Plus. Okay. <laughs> okay. Why, why didn't we make this concept? I feel like this is uh, what we wanted for the Game Boy all these years ago, right? Why? Why is it like this? Did I, just, I just... What? There's certain areas where you fall through the world, too? You can't see everything at once, but you can see like the dirt on the ground where you pound your feet. I am in like the Jump King Mastery Zone now. See? Yeah, see, I fucking made it, man. What? Why? <laughs> you can't see everything at once, plus you can't see some other things at all at once. Plus, okay? I knew it was gonna fuck with me if I did anything, so I, like, switched it twice there, okay? This shit just, like, super meat boy. I, I agree. This reminds me of a actual game called Shift. What was the other game? There's a lot of games, like, from Newgrounds era that look like this. This is definitely just, like, the GB engine. I don't know if this is the actual GB engine that has been circulating. But it looks like it. What is this sound? Are the aliens coming? The alien hive mind. The mothership. There it is. I hear it. I need to jump into the spikes. Maybe they'll abduct me. If I'm dead, they'll smell my blood. They'll bring me into the ship. What? What am I talking about? 
my like the aliens want my blood, I guess. Kind of like Ronald McDonald and Walt Disney. <laughs> Such a silly joke, but I love it. I love it. Walt Disney does want your blood, man. Walt Disney does want your blood. He will harvest your blood and your organs. For when he's revived, he will make the new Mickey 2025. When they bring him out of the fucking, like, freeze tank. After you you give him your blood and organs. Good old Walt Disney will show up. Oh my god. This is fucking horrifying. This hurts. It's the bees. The bees, Justin, they sting. The bees. They're just eternally referencing memes. Sometimes, like, they don't even make sense, the memes I'm talking about. But, like, I know where they're from. Uh, I can do it! I can cast a spell! Wish I could find that one. That was a good one. That was a good one. Why? Why are you cursing me like this? This is worse than, like, original Super Meat Boy, because I know what punishment is. Oh, come on. I made it there, too. I wasn't even looking. No one punishment. You know what? You know what, man? <laughs> you know what, man? You know what, man? I wonder if the developers, uh, you know. I wonder if the. <laughs> what if the developer knows about like the streamers fucking crazy? <laughs> I wonder how he sees it. <laughs> how does he see where he's jumping? How does he see it? I don't know. I don't know. How did I do that? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Just use no clip. That easy. Bruh. <laughs> you know how no clip like lets you break out of the game? I just sort of did like a fourth wall break there. Holy shit. Holy shit. Oh my god, that was good. You saw that. I don't know what you saw, but you saw that. And I'm, I'm just like, wow, okay. This is why I'm here. Why are we here? Just to suffer? Why are we? It's like fucking hovering around. I think it's gonna come get me. The alien UFO is coming. Why am I up here? I thought it was down there. Why, what? what? It's not even a problem, I'm just like freaked out that I'm in a different spot than I thought I'd be. I died 12 times, okay? Doctor Who will come back one more time, but I don't know about that, man. Like, <laughs> they did say Nakuti Gatwa, okay. Wait, what? I died twice? How? How? You can't see your death, so you die again. You cannot make the- You can't make a Doctor Who reference while dying. Okay. Whatever you say. God damn it. <laughs> no, it is Super Meat Boy. It is. We just didn't see all the death counters before. Wait, that's helpful as fuck. Wait, what? How does he know? How does he know? Why? Why? Is, is the plus, like, you, you beat it again and you get, like, the secret replay mode that, like, lets you actually see the Super Meat Boy stuff? I love that every single time I stream, I manage to find, like, a glitch in a game. I just fall through the floor, but I jump back out. I'm like, oh, yeah, that's fine. I'm used to it at this point. Like, I, when I was born, I glitched physics. See? <laughs> I don't know. I think that's probably on purpose, yeah? Or, like, the dev just didn't account for that. Where am I? Germa, where am I? I don't know why I'm begging Germa to help me. Where am I, Germa? Oh my god, I thought I died. I thought I failed. Just have a macro on this swapping to rapidly change so it looks like it's just a flashing background to make parkour easy. He uses no clip. Lemo, you bad. Come on, fucking Unity devs, let me resize your game so I can actually read Chad, you fools. I die a million times here. I win. I win. I win. I won. I win. <laughs> okay, I died to the spike. I'm good, actually. 
I died of the spike, I'm good. I'm dead, I'm alive, I'm dead. Okay, I died of the spike actually, I'm alive, what? How did I only die at the top there? What the fuck? <laughs> He's like a weird alien eyeball creature. I don't know what's wrong with him. I think it's a me. I think I'm the bees, Justin. They sting. What is this all about? Yeah? <laughs> We're just like showing off our level design department? Our devs worked really hard on this. I agree. But I'm confused. Is this actually challenging or... Like, you looked at this and you said it's actually challenging, or... Pachinko time! <laughs> <laughs> I love that with, like, Chad saying, I'm bad, and then I immediately beat the pachinko level. <laughs> like, it's zero tries. Zero tries, I beat the pachinko level. Konami's gonna be so mad at me, man. But that's what they get for firing Kojima. I will beat all their pachinko and make, like, a hundred million dollars live on stream. That'd be fucking crazy. I hate Pachinko. You know why? It's not, it's not even because of, like, the game itself. It's because of the Super Mario level for it. <laughs> it's so dumb, but, like... Uh, I don't remember what it is about it. It's either, like, the, the bonus stage itself, or you go in the Pachinko machine. Or it's like you have to do something really stupid. I think, I think you have to do something really stupid... To get the, uh, like, you know, flood level, where you get your flood taken away from you. And so, <laughs> I seem to remember, like, dying on the floodless stage over and over, and I just kept having to do pachinko. I'm like, I'm going to go insane. I'm already insane. The pachinko has driven me insane. This is what true pachinko-based madness looks like. <laughs> Homegrown Pachinko Madness. The Pachinko Madness. Still bad, he says. They say. I just immediately say he. It doesn't even matter who it is. I just say he. I know you're a girl in real life. I know. I don't know. I was going to say like the guy in real life joke, but I feel like that one's old. Like, yeah, I know you're a girl in real life. I knew it. You're a Send hand pick. Send hand pick. <laughs> that, that was so good for me. Like, the, 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 just that whole moment was hilarious for just me alone. And I hope that everybody else found it funny. But the fa like, the whole moment, right, was good. But then the fact of the matter that I say, Send handpick. I spent five thousand dollars on you on stream. Send handpick. And like somebody actually left. Oh my god. <laughs> There's like not even ego. It's just like wow, wow. <laughs> so somebody like peeked into my mind and didn't think I was crazy. They thought it was funny. That I was funny instead of crazy. <laughs> I'm a dude, not a guy. SMH Kappa. That's right. Dude is a good word. People complain about it maybe not being gender neutral, but I like it. Dude? My dude? My dude? I mean, like, have you seen the memes, dude? My dude? The memes. See, every day I open up my... <laughs> every day I open up my... And I look at my memes. What would it be? Right? How, how, what, like, what depth do you go to? What word do you say? For, like, the proper meme instantiation there. You say, like, you know, I open my newspaper to look at the news. But that doesn't exist anymore. Nobody does that. 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 If you do, you do. But I, nobody does that, right? It's, like, 10% of the whole global population or something, right? That, like, reads the newspaper. I love that I just die in the same spot a million times ranting about newspaper. So like, what what are we doing now? In the current year, that we're like, open the, opening the something and we're looking at the memes. You open the page, there you go. You open the page and you're looking at the memes. See, it's not, it's, we've like, conceptually, just in the words, we've devolved. <laughs> we've devolved. The news is like such a, a hoit couture. 
you check out the news and you're seeing everything new, right? Probably. Well, not in this day. And age. <laughs> not in this day. And age. You you uh you open the page for the memes. See the newspaper. The paper is different. The page. The paper could be several series of pages, or it could just be one sheet of a page, right? What, I like open my phone. No, you open the page and you look at the memes. Next year, we're gonna be like going into the cave and looking at the fire, okay? We will go into the cave to look at the fire. Ow. Ow. It hurts. We will, we will go platonic. We will go to like Play Doh memes. We will. Aristotle will get so jealous. <laughs> I thought I was gonna say like Socrates, but then like my mind immediately goes to Franklin Delano Roosevelt or whoever. Like, wait, what? Like the person on the coin? Or like the important political figure from like world US history class? Why? It was like Franklin Delano Roosevelt, yeah. <laughs> FDR, yeah, this is a present. <laughs> Whoa. Man, FDR. Okay, I die a million times here. I'm, I A million times I die here. What's up, dude? That was up. What's up? Oh my god. This super meat boy like has become so hard. For no reason, the only thing keeping me from doing anything is my death. But the X mark tells you where you die, not where to stand. And so it's like very unclear where you can actually stand. And we got like old school jump mechanics too. So if you change height midair, you lose a lot of velocity. You can like regain it. So it's like super weird. It's super weird. It's a new ground. We're playing Newgrounds. Stop the aliens, the UFO. The UFO is coming. Okay, well, I don't have to beat this, but I'm just like more concerned about if it has an ending. Oh my god. I... <laughs> How did I get all the way up there? How did I get up there? <laughs> I keep popping like a balloon. Pop him. Pop the streamer. I am a balloon. I am a balloon. I am a floating balloon in the sky. I give up. I, gi I give up. <laughs> maybe, maybe I'll come back to that, but I, I give up. <laughs> 100 deaths and I follow. I unfollow. 07 lol. <laughs> I just totally missed that in the chat. Yeah, because like almost every single Unity game is like max resolution possible at all times. At all times. Okay. You can't see everything at once, plus. Nope. Nope, you can't not. Okay. <laughs> Let's try another random game. Switch the music. I don't think so. Juice. What the fuck? Drink juice. Um. Huh? I'm going to drink juice, I guess. Okay, this game does allow windowed. It does allow windowed. Ultra graphics for, like, orange juice. What the? Hold on. You got to wait, man. This ain't WarioWare when you do this shit. This shit ain't WarioWare, man. What? I have to drink juice. I have to, I have to drink juice? Huh? How do, I, how do I drink juice? I'm drinking juice. I'm drinking juice? Uh, how do, how do I drink, like, the orange juice or whatever? What? <laughs> what? What are the inputs? What, what are the inputs? I'm hitting everything on my keyboard. Drink. Okay. Ugh. Ugh. Here's my juice. Ugh. 
Okay, yeah. I definitely accomplished that game. I fucking beat that. I definitely beat that one. What the fuck? <laughs> okay. Well, more butt load games. More butt games. M more butt based games, yes. Keyboard commanders, that's what I am. Plunge? Be the world's greatest plumber. This game requires two players. Uh, man, can you, like, join the Discord? Uh, uh, yeah, there's no fucking way that I'm gonna be able to, like, remote you in. Sorry, man. Plunge. Plunge. I, it, it, it's like a competition game. Okay. I, th I think it's a poop game. I think it's a poop game. Even though there's it's only one player. Okay, I, th I think I will play the poop game. Plunge. Plunge into the depths. And fucking half a Zulu. Half a plunge Zulu. What am I seeing? No, 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 you, 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 hold on, hold on, I'm opening that again, what the fuck did you just show me, what even, was that ultra kill, was that an ultra kill reference, did we just get like an ultra kill reference there, what was that, plunge, capture plunge, okay, <laughs> Uh, okay. This is blunt. Have you ever wondered where does it all go? Have you ever wondered <laughs> where does all the poop go? Have you ever wondered where it all goes? Have you ever wondered where all the poop goes? Well, now you'll know. You'll know where all the poop goes when we plunge it all out and we fucking like huff it. We're gonna huff the poop. This game's so loud. What? <laughs> what the fuck is he saying? Plunge! Plunge! What the fuck? What the fuck? Have player 1 press left to plunge, player 2 press right to plunge. This is literally just a meant to play. Like, you could just play it single player if you want. What the fuck is happening? I feel like I'm I'm in like VR uh, super hot. <laughs> like if I just mouse back in, I'm gonna pull the cat out, and it will be my mouse cursor, and I'm just gonna pull it up to like where my skull is in real life. I'm gonna I'm pointing the mouse at my head. <laughs> where does it all go? Where's the fucking doo doo go? Let's go plunging. Let's go plunge the poop. Send it back. S send it back. Send it back. What the? Uh, I don't want to deal with this shit, Luigi. I, I, don't, I don't want the poop, Mario. I don't want that either, the poop. I don't want the poop either, Luigi. Get out of here, Mario. You gotta go back to the mansion, Luigi. Mario, I'm scared. Get the poop, Luigi. Uh, no, Mario. You're not gonna be on Game Boy Advance, Luigi. I will. I will. Now, Luigi, Mario. <laughs> Mario, I got poo on me, Mario! <laughs> Mario! What the? I win, you fuck, Luigi! What? Is this WarioWare? Really oh my god! I, I really like you both! Oh, yes, Mario. Dada Bio, let's do this, Stecky Dio. Yes, Honto, Mario, Honto. I am the best. I will plunge. Plumber two wins. Plumber two wins. Plumber. Luigi, no! Look away, Nintendo. Today we fuck Mario. <laughs> I will become the fucking poop magician. I will become the poop magician. Stop right now. You shall not fool! 
Hey, the one on the right side completely overflowed. No, 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 you shall not fool. Today we shall fuck Mario. Look away, Nintendo. Oh, the poop singularity will just stay here if we keep it in check. It will eventually collide with one of us. Um, I think like destiny has called. Fate has been chosen, and the poop will happen regardless. So. You ain't shit, Luigi. You ain't shit, Luigi. Uh, well, well, no, Mario, I'm not taking it again. You ain't shit, Luigi. You ain't shit, Luigi. Okay, well, we like the poo force. The poo force. It's duel at play. Summer one win. I win. What was that? Summer two win. What? This is actual shit diary. You ain't shit, Luigi. Is that it, man? Is that it? No, no, Mario. This time, Luigi's Mansion will fuck you. Luigi's Mansion will three. Luigi's Mansion three will shit on you, Mario. Okay. Like very awful Luigi voice. Send it back now. That's right. I have three fucking Luigi's Mansion games. Plumber two win. We have like a fucking poop shower. Plumber one win. Is that Saxton Hale in the sewer level, man? I'm gonna fucking shit on you, Luigi. He yeah, told me I needed to plumb my own basement, Mario. I will shit on you, Luigi. <laughs> I'm scared, Mario. The poop, Mario. You need to eat it, Luigi. No, double dash, Mario. Eat the poop. Both of us can, Mario. No, you will, Luigi. <laughs> Look away, Nintendo. Luigi's got shit on him. I will shit on you, Luigi. I will shit on you, Luigi. See, he shat on Mar Mario shat on him. Is there anything else here? Oh my god, plunge to the beat. What? What? What the fuck? What is this Newgrounds art style? Was this made by Tom Fault? Plunge the toilet. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh Mario. <laughs> we gotta keep it down, man. We gotta like plunge the shit further down. It keeps coming out. That's right, Mario. I'm better than you at that. Yeah, that's right. I bet you plugged the shit up, Luigi. What? What do you mean, Mario? That's right, Luigi. You fucked up, man. What do you mean, Mario? I'm docking your pain, Luigi. <laughs> That's right, you're getting shit pain, Luigi, minimum wage. You can't do that, Mario. You're already making royalties from your fucking Super Luigi game. Craigasm. Okay, I think that's it. I think there's only a few of them. Will Mario win the plunge off again? Find out next time on Dragon Shitsy. Oh, he did. It was really close. It was really close, but Mario won. Player 1 won. What the, what the fuck? <laughs> Just the sound effect is the best thing of that. Luigi starves to death. That's right, Luigi. Now you're gonna eat the shit for dinner. And you're gonna eat the shit for dinner, Luigi. Ah, Mario! We get the toilet flushing sound effect right at the fucking end. <laughs> right at the goddamn end. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Just might, might as well flush this whole fucking stream, right? Might as well flush the whole fucking stream. Pro Crabs Donation. This is one of the things I saw and I was like, this looks fucking insane. Down, Go down the rabbit hole. We will. I heart New York, it says. The crab loves New York. The cra crab. Get your crab emotes ready. Okay. Oh. Oh, no, 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 no. What? St stop. What? Did you hear that? Did you see? Ooh. Oh. Oh. Crab shella. Yeah. The game. 
very cool. Very cool atmospheric music, but the game is like exploding the audio. Crab Shella. Is that like Coachella? We went to Crab Shella with each other. I remember. I remember the Crab Shella trip. Clause. Man, this is no clause for alarm, okay? No clause for alarm. Crab sock? It looks like a fur. What's all this? What's all this then, huh? Like crab underwear? Oh yeah, you got crabs in the underwear. Very funny. What's this? What the fuck? What the fuck? Spider -Man. Japanese Spider-Man? No, 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 what? Japanese Spider-Man, like you're you're gaslighting me, aren't you? You're fucking trying to gaslight me, aren't you? What is he saying? Oh, he was saying like a sp like a coconut spider crab. See, I thought he was saying Spider-Man. We're, we're talking about a coconut spider. Can you shut up, man? We're talking crab panties? We got crab underwear and crab panties. We got multiple crab panties. Yay. We got crab shorts. We got crab keyboard. Yeah. Fucking play that funky music for me, crab man. Yeah. What the fuck? That's not a musical instrument, that's like an automaton. Which is actually a musical instrument nowadays. What the, 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 the what? <laughs> the lustation. The couple danced in harmony, all 16 legs between them scuttling in perfect practiced mastery as their claws clashed. Will this game, like, you, it's so big you can't even see it anyway. It's, it's so big you can't even see it anyway. A tool, and one that spent a long time coming at that. How long has it been since they arrived at something? In all the crustaceous grandeur, taking all the best, most glittery granules of sand to surround their home so that its entrance sparkled just right. The mid-afternoon rays streamed through the water's surface. Too subtle predators to notice, yet the object of envy for any passing crab. How long it has been, watching them paddle about collecting the finest planktons. And damp the ocean had to offer as the current flowed over the immaculately sculpted carapace. Occasionally a piece of half-finished shrimp would drift <laughs> idly by, carried as if by some magical current towards your humble nest. You help the much smaller and partially eaten inferior crustacean in your jaws, your claws, an indirect kiss from your potential lover and affront to your independence. Enough was enough. You had to settle things as nature intended with claws drawn. <laughs> The crods! The crods! Charging towards your fellow de decapod with swimming legs paddling at full speed. They whirl around to face you, having already anticipated your arrival. You lock claws and scuttle about, using any piece of coral to stabilize yourself, hoping to gain the high ground on your opponent. The other crab seems suspiciously unbothered by your attacks. Their obsidian orbs locking gaze with yours. Was that tenderness? Unbelievable. You don't need their pity. You gurgle and froth at the thought. <laughs> well, now that you are up so close, it's plain to see that genetics favored this crab. A prime specimen indeed. You suppose their anterolateral teeth were fairly evenly spaced and pointed at the carapace, a nice vibrant hue that chitin dotted with marks of victories in battle. But now is not the time. Your brief distraction had cost you. The other crab uses your locked claws to pull themselves up onto the rock with you, your shell millimeters apart. You prepare yourself to be struck by their big, meaty claws, as if sculpted by the crabs, the crab gods, themselves. But the punishment has not come. You feel confused relief as the other crab gently starts to pick you off some algae caught on your shell. The touch of the fine claws sending a shiver down your lateral spine. Has global warming intensified recently? <laughs> it certainly feels like there's steam in your gills, you gurgle child. <laughs> Perhaps things were moving too fast for your liking. The other crab stops picking at the algae and begins to scuttle away to give you some space when you clasp one of the claws before they can leave. <laughs> A crab as perfect as them showing an interest in you? Why? 
who won't like other crabs, but your chemistry, it was undeniable. You put them in your hard <laughs> the hardness of their carapace, rubbing against your own maxillipede battling for dominance as your claws scrape to find purchase on their dorsal chitin, giving it to your primal instincts, you. <laughs> Go to crab shallow. <laughs> Holy fuck. <laughs> we we just like fucking we we fucking lose it there. Am I gone? Did I did I die? They banned me from Twitch now. <laughs> AKA L L Heart. AKA Three Heart. I don't know what that is, but it's uh, Madeline from Celeste with like a strawberry heart. <laughs> Read all of it. I was I was intending on doing that. What the fuck? What the fuck? Top 10 crab facts. Crabs first appeared early in the Jurassic period of the Earth's history about 200 million years ago. However, horseshoe crabs have existed nearly unchanged for about 445 million years. Yeah, the, they're perfect fucking specimens of evolution. They don't need to change. You look up fucking horseshoe crab memes... It's a real fucking, like, invest. Invest in horseshoe crab memes. Since crabs have ten legs, that makes them decapods. The largest crab on Earth is the Japanese spider crab with legs spanning about four meters or 13 feet. The smallest crab on Earth is the pea crab, which is a few millimeters or half an inch. Horseshoe crabs are not true crabs. Instead, they belong to a separate class called Merostomata and are more closely related to spiders. That's fucked. That's fucked because the giant thing, like, sitting outside your trash can... In like a new, brave new world, Florida that you live in, Hotline Miami, Florida that you live in. That's a, that's a spider actually. That fucking thing that wandered out of the shoreline is actually a spider. It's clinging to your, clinging to your metal garbage can for some reason. I think it wants like like a hamburger in your garbage. Most wild crabs have an average lifespan of three to five years, with some species living up to thirty and even a hundred years. Some crabs, I think, we like harvest their blood. <laughs> Because it's like good for like uh, you, you know like medicine. We we use this in medicine because they have blue blood. Some species of crabs, like stone and mud crabs, can regrow lost limbs after several over several molting cycles. A lot of things can do that. When they molt, groups of hermit crabs will often line up according to size, so they may trade shells with one another to suit their growing size. That's so cute. There are over 6,700 identified species of crabs split into about 98 families. That's a lot of crabs. That's a lot of crabs. That's a lot of crabs. All life will one day become crab. It is inevitable. <laughs> you should have put that in 10, man. A group of crabs is called a cast of crabs. That's incredible. That's incredible. One, one day, all evolution will lead to crab, I think. Yee claw. Crab Wars. Well, I'm just like back on my old friend's desktop. And he's like, yeah, you can get free music on LimeWire. And he's got like star spoof on the desktop. And I'm like, what's that? He's like, oh, it's dumb. I'm like, what is it? He goes, it's a, like a fake Star Wars. Oh, it's kind of funny, but it's shitty. And I'm like, oh, okay. Crab Wars? Crab Wars, let's go. There's a game in the game and that has games in it. Long time in the fucking crab galaxy, very far away. Episode V I D C C. What number is that? A new crab. The crab warriors of Crustacean, Crustacean, are locked in a deadly skirmish with Lobster Empire. The lone pilot joins the fray above the planet Crab Oil on number ten to one. Will the pilot manage to hold off the invading Lobster Empire soldiers? Or will they face a failure defeat defending the planet? This is your story. This is your fucking story. Crab man. Fire crab. Why are we just still, like in crab meta? Why are we stuck in crab meta? Yeah? Oh my oh my god. I win. I win. That was Crab Wars. I fucking win. Best crab gang meme dot JPEG. Okay. <laughs> G get Carson a day mean gang get Carson a day gang is that how you say that I don't know Latin hey man check this out yee claw let's fucking go boys 
Eclaw, you cannot kill me in a way that matters. Final crap, Tissy. Yeah? <laughs> Welcome, hero, to my evil lair. You think just because you have the claw blade of chaos, you'll be able to defeat me? Don't make me laugh. <laughs> Let us do battle. Uh, okay. Like, fucking ultra attack. Ultra attack. I uh, like fucking limit break. Fucking limit break. Are you ready? R are you ready? Nine, 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 fucking 999 meteor move. I fucking win. My name is Cloud Claw Strike. Cloud Claw Strike. I, I was meant to fucking kill you, Claw Sephiroth. Claw Sephiroth. You will die to my sacred claw blade power. Okay, I will avenge your. Game over. Game over, yeah. <laughs> okay. Lift, laugh, crab. Very cool. You are going to be okay, smile. When you, when you are evolutionarily optimized to withstand the passage of time over millennia by adapting to changes in your natural environment while staying true to yourself, earning you the reputation of being the most successful life form on Earth. Okay, Kabuto. Okay, like, go collect your Naruto, like, trading cards. Crabby clicker. Crab. 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 Fucking crab. Crab. Crap! <laughs> to get crabs! Crap! <laughs> it's a crab! The game is a crab! The game's full of a crab! It's got crabs in it! It's got crabs! Do you eat crab? Do you boil crab? Do you sell crab? Do you purchase crab? How many crabs do you collect? I, I have... I have 200 and 84 crabs. I just added another to my collection. I have 200, I have 300 crabs, okay? <laughs> okay, crab fox, crab versus carrot. Crabs gone wild, ASMR. Uh, that's like 999 trillion views. On April 3rd, 2022, with zero comments? 104 subscribers, Monch the Carrot. Crab enjoyer. Man, you botted your views, man. It's like super obvious. It's it's super obvious that like you botted all your views, man. I'm sorry, but like, uh, Crab Apple, it says. Here, can I like go back in that? Okay. How, how like I exit? Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. How do I, how, 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 how do I get out of the crab zone? How do I, how do I get out of the crab zone? How do I get, how do I get out of the crab zone? No, no, zero likes, lol. The ultimate life form was not Mewtwo. Neither was it Cars. Okay, enough. I, I'm done. There, no more crabs, okay? As much as I'd like to look at everything in that game. Okay, fine, I'll go back in one sec. I, it's just, I don't know how to escape that. I don't know how to get out of that. Why? Why does it make an awful sound? It's an awful, awful sound. Okay, I heart New York. I pick up the shirt. I pick up the pants. I put, like, all of my clothes away. Including, like, my several pairs of different underwear. Congratulations, you put all away all of your laundry and you didn't procrastinate at all. Oh. Well, I, like, overwatered my plant? Crustaceans. Crab jokes for the distinguished gentleman. Why don't crabs like small spaces? They're claustrophobic. How much salt do crabs use? Just a pinch. Why don't crabs like sharing? They're shellfish. So funny. What do you call a crab in a Christmas hat? Santa Claus. Why was the crab in a foul boo? It was feeling crappy. Okay. I won. <laughs> I won. Easy game. Easy game. We fucking beat it. We fucking beat it. I did harvest all of my laundry. I did. I didn't. I me. I immediately went to. I immediately went to bed. Okay. I immediately went to bed without like picking up any of my laundry. What is this? 
Psychic human back joust fencing duels for honor and princess stop. Exit. Exit the game. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Let's like turn the game off. What? I'm gonna leave? NW.exe and it just says exit. I can't I can't even open it. I can't even open it. Okay. I guess this is exit. <laughs> welcome welcome back to uh, like a new grounds game, hmm? Welcome back to like fucking new grounds, huh? Exit? Yeah, exit like fucking all of reality, like exit mine. Completely like delete mine. Delete delete mine completely. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I love the volume is just like 500,000. <laughs> the volume was like 500,000 for a second there. Very cool. Well, that was kind of silly. What else do we get out of this experience? FPS True Love. Blow kisses to turn students into hot and spicy bodybuilders. Yeah, this is a this is the real college experience right here, actually. We were talking about college earlier. This is the real college experience. You get like blow a kiss at somebody from like that's not even in your class, and they're like, oh my god, now I know how to like do all my homework. Holy shit, that's like the that's the only thing I needed to do for like us to like we work on the assignment together. That's all I needed. That's all I needed. Okay, hold on. The, the volume is like super maximized. The volume mixer is freaking out, man. Because these some of these games are like in a really crappy made engine. I don't know what it is, but it like... It opens at max volume and it's, it's like Unity adjacent, I think. It's like it has something to do with JavaScript, I think. Okay, does this work? We good? Yeah, we good. FPS true love. I will find true love in this game. I will. I will. Sutato! <laughs> Sutato, yes. Sutato. Nani? What? They kissed me. No, I kiss you. There you go. Yeah. See, now you're powerful. He ascends into the skybox. Sutato, get kissed. Get kissed. See, now you don't- you don't want me anymore. Nani? Stop, man. I'll give you like a hug from a distance. He is coming for me. He's literally coming for me. <laughs> Nani? The sound effects. Hold on, what? My true love quest. Game over! Yeah, game over. Game- game over. Okay. Let's try again. Sutato! Sutato. <laughs> the jump sound effect. They like the walking sound effect. Get kissed. Get kissed. Get like a smooch from a distance. Oof. Get smooched from a distance. Game over. Well, magic good. Okay, I kiss. I gotta go get like more power. I can only kiss so much before all the boys in town get really mad at me. <laughs> I love this. I love any FPS game with like very airy controls as well. But any FPS game that just like has a really, really, really low effort area to walk around in. But it's like nice. Yeah, this is fantastic. We just got like the soccer trees. We got like some pink fog to fit the trees. And like the atmosphere, of course. We have like our real basic F FPS controls, but it's like, I can just hold onto the wall. But I think this is just Unity meta, right? Hey, how, how do I regenerate my love? Hey, I love you too, not, not just all the boys. <laughs> she's got her tongue out. She doesn't want to kiss. I think she's just along for the ride. Oh my God, they're all coming for me. There it is, there it is, more love. But it just increases my heart. Power up! Power up! Yes! This is 
where I become a J-pop idol. My star, my star will take off. I'm like a rocket propelling a star even further than our sun. Okay. Power up. Well, I can't make them all love me. The army. <laughs> the army. You saying like my fandom army? Like whenever I become a pop star now? Or the army of people coming after me? Or this is what it happens when you join the United States Army? This is what happens when you join the United States Army. Okay, Nani. You power up. Oh my god, oh my god, he's Naruto running at me. I run out of like magical love energy power. Pop star mono! Yes. Toggle pop star mode. Stop. See, my stand ability is to make everyone love me, but what they don't realize is that in Boruto, I actually invert the entire universe. And now, Kawaki is Naruto's son, and Boruto is just some asshole. Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. I'm the creator of this manga, and I say, screw the main character. Screw the main character. Let, let's make his best friend the main character. Screw it, man. Power up! I will kiss them all from a dish. I will smooch them. I will smooch them, and they'll listen to my fucking hot new track. 3.2 million views on YouTube! <laughs> Game over! Game over. Uh, I got 63 kisses. I got 63 kisses in there. <laughs> My fucking god. Okay. Now that's how you make a goddamn video game. I want you to stand on the pillar and see how many of them sp end up spawning after a few- I don't know why I didn't think of that. I kept seeing them follow me, but I didn't think of them like just infinitely spawning. Let's try that really quick. Let me try that really quick. My high score is fucking 63. Starto! Yes. So you have to collect more power. I think like that power up gives you unlimited for a little while. Heart. He is lusting. Stop. Man, I gotta go, like, study biology literally. Not, like, fucking ha-ha. I have to literally study biology, man. Nani? Ow. Don't hug me. It hurts. Game just drops to F 1 FPS after 10 minutes. I hope so. Nani? Nani? Hold on. They all Naruto run up to me. Oh my god, they can fucking dash across. They can dash across. Game over. Starto. Okay. I am Stato. That's something that confuses me about Japanese. Uh, like, if you say multiple of something, it either is just like one of something, or you say like a hyphenated version of it. It's like, it, so with like people, it's like, uh, like, w watch out for all those worms outside. So you say, worm tachi? Uh, am I right? You like say, you watch out for the worm tachi. I'm so used to just the letter S. But I guess. I guess if you like really formally look at the S pronunciation in English, English, it does look like several syllables probably, so. Man, fuck you guys. I'm doing like my cool Kingdom Hearts glitch, hold on. I will Kingdom Hearts glitch you. Oof. Roblox, oof. That SFX. Hold on, I'm fucking, I'm fucking clipping out of the world on him. Get fucked, G. Get fucked, G. I like, I like your cut, G. I like your cut, G. Let's fucking go, boys. We got the kiss. Look at that. Okay, as someone who is like, uh, you know, somewhat game developer, I should have like called this. Let's see how long this lasts, huh? I'm just holding S. I'm afraid I'll fall. I know how like engines like this work, but I, I could still fall even if. Even if I've somehow managed to, like, hang on here. 
All right, we got like a lot of fans and we got like Angie salary man that needs something like he, uh, he needs a pick me up. A lot of fans, man, a lot of fans. Pose for the fans. Yeah, there he is. The game so badly wants me to go over there. I could, but see the problem is once I spawn more, they will spawn even more exponentially. So I don't know when to quit. Looking at how the why, looking at how they dash, it seems to be some sort of magnet code. Yeah, they're just directly coming straight to me, and they're spawn closeting or spawning anywhere, or they're just spawning where I'm not looking. <laughs> They get close to a pillar, they get pulled to it. Yeah, I don't think they jump. I think they just don't really see it. <laughs> They're only looking for me. And since I'm not on an actual pillar, they can't jump at me. Oh, yeah. I think if anything, it like kind of pushes them. I don't know. This is great. Just uh, like piano. It wants me to get a power up so bad. The developer wants me to get a power-up so bad to, like, garbage collect. <laughs> You've got too many of them on screen, man. They're, like, actually taking up physical space. They're taking physical space up on the processor. <laughs> the CPU is expanding, man. You only have, like, 11 more seconds before your computer explodes. I, re I really want them to push each other off. I'm waiting for it. Collect them, aggregate them, put them all in a box and wait for it to happen. I wonder if it's not even like how many collisions we can fit on a space. It's more just like uh, we're tossing it up and it really looks like, oh yeah, we're. I think we're just tossing it up. It sort of looks like we fit in a grid based system, even though we don't like collide with the world that way. Um, it's because that's true. <laughs> <They're>, <laughs> we collect enough of them in there, they will start juggling each other, I think. Like, the entire system, this whole network of NPCs, will start becoming like an infinite... I so badly just want to say infinite Tsukuyomi, because I said Naruto and Boruto and shit. This will just become like a network of infinite... Infinity symbols. All infinitely moving. <laughs> We've unlocked the actual climb bottle. We've unlocked the climb because it keeps adding. This is theoretically infinite. Okay, it's an additive climb bottle. But I, I, you know, I, to be fair, I don't think it's self-contained. You could say like climb bottle universe goes outside of climb bo bottle universe. Sure. I think this climb bottle is like not a closed system. I think it's about a, it's going to expand at some point. It'll either burst or they will start shuffling very rapidly. Soon enough, you'll create a black hole, I really hope. There she is, there she is. She's so angry down there. Watch her coming up for me. She's coming. There she is. I wonder if we'll like stack power-ups. Oh yeah, they're vibrating now. Uh, it's kind of like a marching band. We've, we've created the marching band. The goal of procrastination was to make me to procrastinate, you know, but now I'm procrastinating here. <laughs> so here's my theory. Every entity has like its own PNG space for its collision. Because that that's what we just did for like to make everything fit easily, I think. Otherwise, it, like, it probably would have looked weird, right? We, we sort of clipped it just a little. I think every NPC has like slight... Just a slight transformation at, like, their size. So I think we're sorting. <laughs> I think we're sorting them. <laughs> you're just, you're looking at my processor. At a certain point, the randomness will actually just be, like, my processor scheduling. And you'll just be looking at it like a peak. If you were futuristic enough and you had, like, you know, 2027 tech, you could actually, like, poke this image and see exactly what my processor is doing right now. But most of us are just not advanced enough to do this, right? Like if you have 2027 chat GPT running on like Godot 50, <laughs> you can like peek into this. 
Because we killed Unity at that point. We killed Unity. Sort by recent... <laughs> oh, now they're going fucking crazy. <laughs> I'd like to imagine that if they had a sound effect, it would be going absolutely, utterly nuts here. I don't think we're sorting anymore. Uh, I think whatever logic I was talking about before, I don't think it's sorting. Um, what it looks like now is like 3D voxel tech. And I don't quite know how to make the engine work. So I've spawned in the NPCs and it kind of works. But like the 3D effect I was looking for is broken as fuck. I'm getting like 16 copies per one NPC. And like I'm trying to look at them from just real like 3D space angles. And it, it, instead it's giving me like 16 different really weird math transformations. I think they stopped spawning. Yeah, I think so too. Oh my god, there, there he is, there he is, there he is, oh fuck, oh fuck, there they are, there they are, no, they're here, they're here, what the fuck, there he is, there's Hadofo boyfriend, <laughs> I say that, but that, that's like a fucking, what, <laughs> the sticky bomb, <laughs> what, Pawa Apu, there he is, there's Sasuke, there is Sasuke. He's so sad. Sniper rifle. <laughs> Love sniper. <laughs> Let's fucking go, boys. Whoa. Okay. <laughs> I don't think there's other weapons or anything. <laughs> I will kiss everyone in the universe. I will! I will kiss them all! I will kiss them all! I will share my love with everyone! Just like Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy! Nani? Nani? I can't love everyone in the universe. It's physically impossible. Even if, like, my mind could comprehend it, it's still impossible. Like, by the time I kissed everyone, I would die. Or even if I was eternal, like, there would, I just couldn't keep up. People would keep spawning. By the sheer fact that I'm a human in the universe, and I like people would just like my I, my thoughts at that point. Like if I was eternal, I th I think my mind would just generate humans. I don't even think like I would try to be psychic or like create universe. I think it would just happen. I bomb all of them with love. Kill Sasuke. I think that's what Sakura did, right? <laughs> we replaced him. Sai drew a new Sasuke to replace the old one because he was just so bad. What is on my hand? Why am I drooling all over my hand? Why am I drooling all over my hand? Why am I drooling all over my hand? Is that drool? Is that like dog slobber? Okay, we gotta find Sasuke. Even though there's like a large crowd. Oh my god! The game's still rendering all that damage. <gasps> Look at all my devoted followers. They ascend into the sky. Look at them go. Look at them go. My loyal. They deleted themselves. That was so much lag. I, I, I thought for a second the game was like, you win, you win. You win. And then I was like, oh. Oh. Shopton, oh, Shopton happened. Well, I guess I get a new high school, yes. The fucking love bomb. There he is, there's Sasuke, there's Sasuke. I got Sasuke right at the end. I, I missed him, I missed him, I missed him. Well, there he is. <laughs> what the fuck? I knew this pack would be full of like some good stuff, some goodies. I didn't get to- I didn't expect to get like a full Twix bar 1100 times in my Halloween bag. Like every house I went to on Halloween just gave me a full candy bar. Holy fuck. <laughs> okay. 206 loved, easy, rigged. That's right, this is a pre-recorded stream by the way. Crab cake? No, no, that looks good. Button companion app. Press the button or don't. No. It requires six players. Cult classic. 
requires four players. Bleed on the floor, become Satan, and kill the other cultists. I will play as all the other players. I don't care. I will play as everyone. It's just called Satanic Ritual in the game configuration menu. Well, uh, <laughs> if you're looking for a tutorial, okay, you find out here first, okay? Now, if you're looking for a tutorial, see, we're looking for a satanic ritual tutorial. Look here. No, look no further. Okay, you see. I'm the red guy. I, I'm the red guy. No. No. Someone's... I'm the... I, sus. Sus, dude. I'm the yellow guy. Where's the other guy, huh? And, like, I put your blood on Satan's massacre pole. His massacre hall will contain all of your blood. Go, go, I sacrifice you, man. I sack you, all of your blood. Wait, he became the dark one. I slaughter the dark one and make more blood. He got 100 with that one bomb, yeah. And now the Dark Lord will power me up even further. See, I am the Dark Lord. I am the Dark Lord. Cultists to survive. I am the Dark Lord now, you see. That's kind of cool. That's kind of cool. It's like just a neat multiplayer game if you want one. I like that. Uh, if you want a tutorial. If you want a tutorial, there you go. That's how you become the Dark Lord. The Dark Lord. The Dark Lord. Okay. Back to the butt load. Buck's gravity shifting escape from dude shapes. No. Crayon run. Come together. Don't finish first? Hold on, what? This game contains not safe for work content. <laughs> I was I was about to be like, yeah, hold on. I'm, I'm just gonna like check this out really quick. <laughs> for a split second, I was like, oh yeah, that's just like, that's a silly joke. Now I'm seeing like their matching clothes and like their pants and like the weird look. The, just like the very weird look on their faces. Is that Pocahontas? Yeah, look, look at their pants. Like, they're, they're wearing socks. Okay. <laughs> they're wearing socks. Hellbound Hellhound. Go to hell. This one I've seen in the, like, this is what this pack has. So I gotta look at this. The game refuses to open. Then play it. Blur the screen and play it. Oh my god. What? <laughs> it's it's just V V V V V V V but worse. What? What the fuck? Oh, let me like not bleed your ears. Yes. Were you Walt need, Walt Disney need your ear blood? Okay. But the Hell Hellbound Hellhound it will. Like, fucking harvest your blood too early, I think. Woof, 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 woof. Chat, chat, chat. Chat is just full of a woof. Chat is just spamming woof. Here we go. Well, a flight of the fucking hellhound Valkyries, I guess. What? What? We just make this? My, my man, like, made this in also college class. But he's, like, laughing. He was laughing his ass off in the class the whole time. And literally everyone was looking at him like, Whoa, man. But, like, he kept zoning in on making the game as he was, like, playtesting it. That he just, like, he was not paying attention to anybody in class. It didn't matter. It didn't matter how hard he was laughing. He was self-conscious of it, but it didn't matter. And he's just, like, cackling in the classroom, I think. When he was making this. I don't even think he was studying when he, he, like, he probably decided, like, I'm gonna make something. And he was in the middle of making this ar already anyway. But he was like, oh, the notes for this class somehow today are actually very easy. So I, like, and he just starts cackling wildly. Like, he already had the notes for this. Because he did the bonus assignment, and the teacher, like, pulled a fast one. And the bonus was actually, like, the, you know, next week's assignment. So he, he got it done. He just sat here and made, like, Hellhound Dog Game. 
Flight of the Valkyries into hell on dog game. Go to hell. Yeah, I'm going to hell. This is what happens when you go to hell. Woof, 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 woof. I think it's, yeah, it's every sign you pass on your way to hell. I'm good. I found the true meaning of the universe. 42, go to fucking hell, man, as a hellhound, and then come back out. Woof, 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 woof. All right, man, all right. Hell is too much work to go to. I think I will go to heaven instead. Yeah, I'm in the same boat. I feel like hell is way too much effort. You gotta go, like, follow three on people. I don't think I want to do that shit. Where was it? He plays it. You know what? We already we already missed out, man. We already missed out on the porno game. Dark Rose, let's go. Let's go. This was one of the ones I saw and also looks really cool. Requires four players, but who fucking cares? <laughs> what? <laughs> it's a, like fucking dev sound effect for the boot up. Dark Roads is best played with four controllers. Oh. Hell yeah. What? Okay. There's not four controllers connected. Keyboard controls will activate. Okay. For keyboard controls, view the readme file in the game's directory. You may need to sacrifice yourself in order to help your group survive. Is this like Gods Will Be Watching? Now I really want to play that. I'm like, write that down. That game fits this kind of music, too? Like, this vibe of, like, holy fuck, we're all on Dead End Road, and we're all actually gonna die anyway. Like, that kind of music. No country for old men looking ass. The fuck? This is like proto vaporwave. Someone must step forward or the whole group will die. To step forward, you must press A on your controller. Okay. A. The story will change depending on who lives and who dies. Choose wisely. Dark roads. Press any key to start. I'm going to turn the keyboard on instead of the cursor. Uh, the, the controller, I mean. I press any key. I press any key. I press literally any key. Drive faster, this is taking too long. It says red. Can't drive any faster, Ren. There's too much fog. I mean, I could, but I'd probably crash us in the process. At this point, that's a risk I'm willing to take. If it means getting out of this car faster, I'm with Ren. He's got a 42 on his shirt. Let's go. Let's go. We just, like, crossed over. So we'll have to kill number three then first. I don't even know, like, who the character numbers were. This is the speed I'm going. If you guys don't like it, you can take your chances walking. Wow, Rod, that's harsh. I didn't expect that much from Kate, but you? Who's Kate? What does Kate have to do with all this? Actually, Elijah, if it were up to me, you'd both be walking. Oh, come on, Kate. We know you'd never- Oh, her name's Kate. Why do we stop? This intersection isn't on the map. We shouldn't be turning left for another six miles. But it says there isn't an exit if we go straight. Maybe we took a wrong turn? Or someone could have just switched the signs around. My brothers used to do that all the time back home. Whatever the case, we should just keep moving till... What? Whatever the case, we should keep moving. Just tell me where to go. Okay, I disconnected from Twitch. I'm back. Somebody has to tell him where to go. Okay. Who gets to pick where we go? Alright, I'm gonna let chat pick. Press A to volunteer. Oh my god, okay. What? I just have to press A on some controller, but I, I, I think we should head left. It's the direction we were going to have to turn anyway. Okay. Okay, left it is. I will... I don't know. They continue to drive until... I think it's like if controllers aren't detected, then the keyboard will take over for the rest. I think that's what it was saying. As the skies are blue... They continue to drive until... The road takes a sharp left onto an unmarked road. A no winter maintenance sign looms to the right and is all but consumed by the grapevine coiling around it like an ancient snake. 
Snake? As they drive along, shapes appear among the branches. Old trailer homes line the woods like graves. Vacant shells of summer homes rotting alone beneath like pine trees. The road ends in a clearing. More trailer homes line the edges of a roundabout, silently as if waiting for something. A fountain stands proudly in the middle, but the water is stagnant and dark. Perhaps each player that chooses to take over changes the story? That's what I'm thinking. I don't know what the controls actually are, so I'm just going to spam the keyboard and see what ending I get. We're like, you know, zero player streamer right now. I could just do nothing, I guess. The car lurches around the fountain to leave, but comes to a halt, tires skidding on the loose gravel. I feel a sky's a room. That's just all I hear here. On a narrow path in the tall grass stands a child. The car is left, forgotten, in pursuit of the child. She leads them down a winding path through thistles and weeds, into another clearing, lined edge to edge with the husks of mobile homes, and disappears. Is this like some story that like friends came up with? Is this like real life and we're like, hey, our friend in like the trailer park neighborhood, Becky, like we try to teach her stuff because her parents suck. Let's go like teach her something today. This is like the horror story, right? One by one, the lights flick on inside the trailers. Shadow figures stand in the windows, staring down the intrusion in their home. No choosing ending, let's go. I'm literally going to spam the keyboard. It's the same thing to me anyway. It gets me something unique anyway. We're still listening to music in the car, I guess. That's this. Yeah, that's this. The doors start to creak open. Hinges screaming from years of rust and decay. Shriveled hands pry at the door frames, urging the doors to open. They need to return to the car, but there were trailer homes surrounding that too. Someone needs to draw the attention away from the car. Who will stay behind? Alright, you weirdos, I'm over here. Rudd's shouting draws the beings towards him. Hinges pop and break as shriveled bodies tumble out, their withered skin snapping and twisting as they race towards him. If he runs fast enough, he might still make it to the first... He might still make it. The first hand that grabs Rudd's ankle is shaken off, but then another one takes his place. Rudd falls hard onto the ground, kicking and shrieking as he tries to pry the hands away. But there's too many. They're digging into his arms, legs, and belly tearing away chunks of flesh and organs. Rudd's last sight is of the car's headlights. Rudd's last sight is of the car's headlights fading in the distance. This is like a fucking zombie horror game. Nobody, nobody's driving. Nobody's driving. Nobody's driving. Drive faster. This is taking too long. You can't drive any faster, Ren. There's too much fog. Nobody's here. Nobody's here. We're all hallucinating. We're all, like, denying it. We're all denying it. We're all denying it. At this point, that's a risk I'm willing to take. If it means getting out of this car faster, I'm with Ren. <laughs> I, I, um... <laughs> wow, Ren, that's harsh. I didn't expect that much from Kate, but you? Actually, Elijah, if it were up to me, you'd both be walking. Oh, come on, Kate. You know we'd not... Let's go, we sacrifice number three. Why did we stop? This intersection isn't on the map. I want to help me. You want to help me, he says? What the fuck is going on? Oh, uh, what? I think we should head left. <laughs> we're, just, we're just gonna do the same thing all over again. The car eases into the water, what? and small waves ripple out in front of it, parting the leaves and sticks like boats in a storm. The headlights bounce off the cr like the headlights bounce off the cresting waves like shattered glass. Why'd we stop? Well, uh there's no one driving. I legit thought we were gonna get the same story, I'm sorry for skipping, but uh this thick veil of fog distorting the light into spectral shapes and figures dancing along the edges of the gloom. Water sloshes around the tires and against the undercarriage of the car, but the wheels still manage to find purchase in the sludge. Slowly it moves forward through the murk. Ten feet from the edge of the road, the car lurches back, wheels spinning helplessly in the mud. The engine revs hard and demanding, trying to force the car out of the gnarled clutches of the swamp. It rocks forward slightly as the tires scramble to grip 
the slippery ground, but eventually the tires stop and the car stills, stuck. I see clouds of blue. The doors slam open and close as the passengers exit to push the car free. The water is bitter cold, seeping into their skin and nestling snug against their bones. The bud grabs their ankles and holds firm, each step, making each step a struggle. Clammy hands grab the bumper as frozen feet slide deeper into the mud. Yo, this is real. Somebody's gonna die. Thunder falls like bombs in the distance and the wind whistles through the trees like whispers. The car starts to move slowly at first and then gaining speed. They're nearing the shore, but the wind is howling now. The trees shake and groan as branches crack and fall around the car. It isn't safe. They need to get back inside, but someone needs to push the car out first. Who will do it? I submit! Elijah's hands shake as he pushes the car along. It's already built up some momentum, but the mud is clinging to his every step. The wind howls in his ears as he gives the car a final shove. The tires finally grip onto something and the car jolts forward, leaving Elijah to fall into the muddy water. The icy weather wrenches a gasp from his chest, and the water fills his lungs where air should be. Suddenly the water is much deeper than before, and the shadows dance across the edges of his periphery, coaxing him to fall further into the cold, murky depths. Ghostly faces are waiting down there for him, their pale arms outstretched for a cold embrace, and Elijah recoils, lashing out against their spectral hands. He struggles to pull himself away, but as his fingers dig into the solid earth, he pulls with what remains of his strength until he is safe and spluttering beside the car. Gasping breaths wreck his body as he pulls open the car door and slumps into the warm seat of the vehicle. Someone turn on the heater and let's get moving. He's dead. 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 He didn't even survive. He thought he survived. That was like the hallucination of him living. That was what he hallucinated as he died. He can't drive any faster, Ren. There's too much fog. We're just like outside of like, you know, the, the, the McDonald's play place. Or like the roller coaster amusement park. You know, like, we're, we're not driving anywhere. At this point, that's a risk I'm willing to take. What? Just help me? He's dead. He's dead. I think it was all Kate. I think it was all Kate. I think it was all Kate. Actually, Elijah, if it were up to me, you'd both be one. <laughs> I think it was Kate. The car is sentient. Yeah, it's talking to us in the radio, I think. Where do we go, man? Where do we go? Like, who votes next? The car was dating them all. The car needs to decide who's the true waifu. Who gets to pick where we go? I see clouds of blue. Straight ahead. We can always turn around if it's a dead end. Do, do you even play this game? They continue to drive until the car starts sputtering several miles from the intersection, its engine coughing on the fumes that it's running on. A gas station sits quietly on the horizon, a single streetlight flickering on and off above it. They roll to a stop a few feet from the farthest pump, the fuel gauge reading far below empty. The pumps look to be in working order, but nothing happens when the trigger is pulled. The generator needs to be turned on before the gas pumps will work. The gas station is small and unlit, the door swings idly on its rusty hinges, and a cold breeze wafts from inside. It's been a long time since anyone has been here. The car's driving itself! The car's driving itself, John! Nature is seeped back into the building. Branches stretch in through broken windows and vines burrow into the cracks in the once solid foundation. The generator is in the back room, surrounded by unopened boxes of chips and candy. They flip the switch and the fluorescent lights hum to life for the first time in years. But with the light, something... But with the light comes something else. It scrambles behind the boxes. It's screeching and spitting. Hackles raised and teeth gnashing. They make a break for the door and slam it shut just in time to feel the creature smash into the flimsy wood. Waifu Royale about to happen. Who can give the car its food first? I think the car's eating people. The door groans and protests, but persistent hands hold firm against the frame keeping the beast at bay. They need to get back to the car, but somebody needs to hold the door. Who will hold the door closed? I already know who it's going to be. 
I've got this. Go fill up the car. Ren braces themselves along the door frame, struggling to hold it closed as the creature throws all of its weight into the rotting wood. Its claws rake along the floor, and the snarling grows louder and longer its trap. Ren knows they need to make a break for it or the door is going to give way. They take a breath, then another, and sprint through the station towards the car. They hear the wood splintering as the door gives way. The heavy sound of footfalls gains on them. Just as they're about to leave the building, the beast grabs their leg, digging into the soft flesh of their calf. Mm, Ren, soft flesh. <laughs> Razor-sharp claws shred away at the skin and muscles of their legs. Sour air wafts around their face as the creature sinks its rotted teeth into their necks. Ugh, finally. I knew it was Kate. I knew it was Kate. This whole time I was like, if I get to pick, I, I like Ren, but I know it's Kate. I want to be Kate. It's Kate. They exit the vehicle and fade into the shadows. It was Kate. Dark roads. Hey, that was pretty fucking good. I don't even know if I like even got to pick anything there. It actually felt like I wasn't even really doing anything, but that was cool. That was cool for like a short visual novel game. I like that a lot. That like t that, that tickled my fancy. That hit my taste buds, you know. I tasted that. I could taste that. I was I was like the weird creature. Okay, I was the weird beast creature, and I could taste her neck flesh. It was delicious. It was delicious. My sour teeth sunk into her neck. Kate, the true waifu. Let's see. I could count on like two hands how many people named Kate that I've dated. No. <laughs> All right, no, Pico Pumpkin. Is this literally Pico Eight? Ah, I'm good. Target practice? No, no. Fire employees? No. Become a lovely flower. Brains. Brains. Where's the porno game, man? Where's the porno game? Demons. Fight off your personal demons. You don't need porno game. Hey, uh, look look away from this. Like, covers an anime girl image with, like, toasters. And just, like, all the areas you don't even expect. Cover, covers her socks with toasters. You don't need to be seeing this. Get back in there. Get back in Fortnite, gamer. You don't need to be seeing this. You don't need, you don't need to be seeing this. I thought it said 60, 6940 by 1080. I was like, oh my god. Can my computer even handle that? <laughs> Can my computer even render that? Please, take a seat. Welcome. What? It's just, oh, okay. It saw the Steam thing. The OBS saw the Steam thing for some reason, which it rarely does. Please, take a seat. Thank you for finally deciding to come see me. I want to see my inner personal demons. No! Now, I just need to ask you a few questions. It's just a standard procedure. Please take your time and answer them all truthfully. Let's begin. Are you happy? <sighs> yes. 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 I'm happy. I see. Very interesting. Have you ever felt lost? All the fucking time, dude. Hmm. Yes. Do you like yourself? No, no, but yes, 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 yes. Sometimes no, but all the time yes, but usually no, but also yes, yes. I see. Have you found yourself stressed lately? All the fucking time. What do you mean lately, man? All right. You want things to stay the way they are now? Uh, no, man. Like, I wanted to improve. Stay? No, I have to. Sometimes change could be good. I'm glad you feel the same. Stagnation. The same thing 30 million billion times over and over again. Stagnation. Stagnation. It looks like that all the time we have for today. Uh, there's one last thing I want to tell you. Please remember it. It is the most important thing I can tell you. Everyone has demons. It is possible to overcome them. Do not give in to the darkness. Do not let your light fade. Stick close to your light. You might be okay. I'll see you again soon. Thank you, uh, like, personal inner demons, like, Emacs as psychotherapist. Thank you. Thank you, chat GPT psychotherapist. Thank you. Oh, no. Oh, no. I'm in Hollow Knight. What the fuck?
The demons will come. The demons will come after me, man. I will fucking die to the demons. Oh, it's just devil daggers. We're in devil daggers. Do I have a dodge roll? Wait, this is enter the gungeon. We have degle, degle, degle daggers enter the gungeon. Enter the gungeon. I win, I win, I win, I win. Light, I need to find the light. I need to find the light. The light. I need to find the light. Oh my god, they're horrifying. My demons are horrifying, I love them. I love my horrifying demon. Oh, I'm running out of light. And like, the more I shoot, the more light I lose. This is a pretty good idea. Hey, this is a pretty good idea. Hey, man. Hey, you came up with like a pretty novel idea. I think if you post this instead of having this in this game pack, my guy, uh, Hey, blah, 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 blah. see you in like three years, whenever you like, f like monetize this and like make a full game. I'll see you then whenever I like remember this and play it again. Uh, hey man, you should like monetize this. Rewind. Blah, 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 blah. You should like monetize this and also like, you know, like Hollow Knight memes, man, and like Dead Cells. Yeah, don't go Dead Cells route, but you know, like Hollow Knight memes, man. You're right in there, man. You're, you're right in, you're in the Hollow Knight memes pipeline with your game. Hold on, man. Hold on, man. Your entire fandom's gonna like post depression memes, man. Ready? Like your game's gonna blow up, dude. Hold on, just like post a quick depression meme. And like have a lot of lore. Okay, in this like black and white demon shooty game. Yeah. I will give in to the demons. I 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 give in to the demons. Let me in. Let me in. I give in to the demons. I give in. I give in to the demons. Let me in. Let me in. Shakes the bars. Let me in. Let me in. I give in. I give in. My darkness. The darkness. Nothing happened. Okay. I gave in to the darkness. Very good. The fucking Binding of Isaac. Adjacent. Very cool. Very cool. Very cool. Oh. Oh no. It looks like the demons got you. You weren't strong enough. But there's still hope. You still have some light left. Hold on to that light and never let go. Come back when you're ready to try again. Goodbye. But like, do my answers matter in the opening dialogue? Or is that just like for the dev to like collate? <laughs> okay. The game closes itself. The game closes itself. 2.2 player, 2.2% 2 .2 of players have this achievement. Play pro crabs the nation. My God. Okay. I think we'll spend too much longer on this as much as I'd like to play all of them. Oh my God. Slap anime butts. Yeah, of course that is not safe for work. Draw the CDs so I can has feedies? No. Fancy trash. Steal the fanciest trash in the world. Fatality. No. Is there anything else I- <laughs> Wait, what? S FPS true love your viewers. But your Twitch chat spawns the enemies. <laughs> how do I even like Twitch chat integration this? How do- how do- whoa, 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 whoa. What? What? How, how does this even work? How does this even work? You want my stream key? <laughs> hey guys. <laughs> hey guys, if you want to, uh, if you, if you want to like spam enemies at me in this game, uh, I, I guess. I don't, I don't know how it works. I, I don't know how it works. I guess you can spawn enemies on me. <laughs> uh, any like developers in the chat know how this works? Stato. What the fuck? It, it just has Twitch chat integration. Like what? Is there okay? Does this like employ a viewer for this? Uh, maybe. <laughs> Is it Good Girl Sage, or are you just like a random viewer? I think you are just a random viewer. Hey, shout out to you. 
I, I don't know if the like a, I don't know if the bot actually like works. <laughs> I don't know if the bot actually works. Hey, uh, <laughs> yeah, can we like try to chat command spawn? Yeah, I, I don't know if it, I don't know if this works. I'd have to look at the documentation for that. I'm not pulling that up. Okay. I'm not pulling up the documentation for the Twitch chat integration for that. We've already played that game. FPS true love with your viewers. Full moon. Don't get caught flashing your butt. This is what's going to get me banned on Twitch. Right here. This this right here will get me banned on Twitch. <laughs> Called classic. F okay. Survival card game. No. Stealing wallets. Another ass game. Another ass-based game. The Flame. Survive the night by any means necessary. This is literally what I was talking about, right? The Scarlet Cypress Hotel. Okay, we... Online multiplayer. Yo. Looking at the viewer list and oh god, there's like 20 bots. Yeah. I don't know like how it affects the viewer count at all. So I just leave them most of the time. I'm not sure like what... Do you ban bots on Twitch? I'm not sure, like, what the meta is. See, I think I, most of them are, like, community bots, I think, so I just leave them. I don't know, like, what a bad Twitch bot is. Like, which ones do you ban? Because, like, I know there's some that are just, like, I want to listen to your stream at all times, and, like, I will just, like, fucking... Edit Hatsune Miku eating Cheetos over it. You can't do that. You can't. You can't be doing that. This is called The Flame. It's got a very cool intro. God damn, all of these tracks. I don't know, what do you think? Should I ban all of the bots? I think I should ban the bots? We do like a RuneScape bot nuke. The Flame, how to play? Click and drag your campers to the forest to gather wood. You can drag things into the fire to keep it lit. Okay. Okay. I understand. I understand. Okay. 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 <laughs> go. Go gather wood then. Yeah. yeah. What the? Roxy leaves the camp to look for firewood. Who's gonna die first? The pale moonlight glistens on the leaves of the forest trees. Ban everything, even yourself. It travels through the forest until they see a clearing in the center of the clearing. Roxy finds nothing. Two hours pass. I take the schmuck. You go to the forest. Geo begins walking towards the forest, but decides against it and turns around. On their way back to the spot, they trip on something and fall. When you look at what tripped them, Geo finds one piece of wood. Okay. You throw wood into the fire. You throw more wood into the fire. Okay, you go look. You go look. You don't. I know you don't want to. Tatiana begins walking towards the forest and looking around. On their way back to their spot, they trip on something and fall. What? Okay. <laughs> is this really simple? Uh, th again, this is just gods will be watching. This is just gods will be watching. You have to optimize it. Bob enters the forest in search of more firewood, thinking to himself. They find a rotting corpse on the ground. It's half decomposed with multiple bones exposed. No big deal. Bob finds one piece of wood, aside from the fucking body. Aside from the body, you know, Bob finds wood. Roxy goes into the forest carrying an axe. They chop down a tree. But it's like too heavy, right? Roxy finds nothing. You. You. Tatiana leaves the camp to look for firewood. Pan everything, even yourself. The pale moonlight glistens on the leaves in the tree. Yeah. In the center of the clearing, they also see a dead body. Like, everybody sees the dead body. You again. The fire will go out because of you. As they are walking, they see another por person in the corner of their eye. They look, turn to see the other person. Their gaze is familiar. Another person who looks exactly like them. The familiar, familiar stranger lifts an axe, and it lowers swiftly at Roxy's head. The killing blow struck. The familiar stranger walks in the direction of camp. Well? Um. How about you get out of here, man? Uh, is it aliens? What the fuck? Time passes and nothing eventful occurs. Roxy fucks everything up, Sim. Do we just send her back out, man? Wait, she, she's gonna kill everybody. 
as they're walking, they see another person in the corner of their eye. Well, <laughs> well, it's exactly you. It's exactly you. The stranger wielding an axe is you and kills you and replaces you. They replace you. It's like a body snatcher. He, it, they are you now. They are you now. I'm gonna run out of fuel for the fire. Give me fuel, give me fire, give me damage, damage, damage. They reach a hole near the fucking tree and find nothing. Mm -hmm. Amen. Bob walks into the woods. It should be like daytime by now. It's been 12 fucking hours. Even if it was like, uh, like fucking 8 p.m., it's game over and we die. You tried your best, but it wasn't enough. You couldn't save them. I don't want to. But you chose not to get desperate. You chose not to make sacrifices. You stood your ground, and they died? Maybe you don't care about getting the highest score. Maybe you really do care about these fake people. I respect that. So I'll let you and your campers go. All right, campers, just this once. Just this once. Next time, you won't be so lucky. It was all your fault, Roxy. It was all your fault. If you didn't fucking install the porn game, Roxy. <laughs> this wouldn't have happened. This wouldn't have happened. Okay, that was pretty chill. I felt like there was no point. What the fuck is this? The Scarlet Cypress Hotel. So, uh, let me pull it back up just before you can... Uh, before we jump into it so you can see it. Okay. 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 Yeah, I think this might be like the last game for now, unless I go back and see something insane. And maybe I'll return to this pack. Maybe. It, it's definitely interesting. I, I'm i not sure like how much of this is just like we tried our hardest to make so many genres. I don't know how much of it is that and how much of it is uh, it's just, you know, we said one developer was actually the, the developer for like a lot of stuff here. It was the arrow keys to... I didn't get to see that. I didn't get to see that, man. I didn't get to see the controls. It's a multiplayer game, apparently, so... Let's give it a try. Let's give it a fucking try. Okay, now it should be picked up. Checking in. Scarlet Cypress Hotel. What the... Okay. It does show you the controls, but I guess... Here it is. Use the arrow keys to move your character. Press T to type your message to chat. Enter to send the message. Press Z to grapple a player. What's grappled? Both players must rapidly press Z. So you just have to win the attack. As a living player, hold X to chant. Ghost players may fly into a chanting player to possess their body and return to life. The chanting player will die in the process. That's fucking cool. Enter the graveyard. Here lies Rain Drinker. Let his pixels go back to the stars they came from. Here lies Sebastian Skyini. May this game live longer than he did. Here lies Patrick Flattery. May his last breath echo in your ears forevermore. Okay. After the Scarlet Cypress Hotel. This is multiplayer. This is multiplayer. I love pooping. I love pooping. Am. Am pooping right now. Pooping. This is like multiplayer online, but uh. Sus! Will I connect the players? I left. I left. I was the only survivor. Sus! I was the only survivor. What? How do you, how do you fucking type? Sus! Dude! You, what? You can only type one per click, I see. Dude! Where are you guys? What the fuck? Okay. Well, uh, it seems nobody's playing this simultaneously, unfortunately, but it's a really cool concept. Hey, sus! I think that might do it for the buttload of free games.
I'm gonna look like one more time and see if there's something else worth our time here. Whoa, save your computer. Monster.exe, what? What the fuck is this? I see, well, that's what I was talking about. If I see something insane. Where are you guys, dude? Sus. I'm all alone here. I thought you were gonna play together. Yeah, I, I told it to open in window mode. I told it to open in 1920 by 1080 window mode and it absolutely does not. It's not a game. You must save your fucking computer with this. Yeah, no, I open it again. Because you ignored my configuration. So maybe I just didn't press it right. No, I did press it right. You're crazy. I guess the 1920 mode doesn't work. Monster. Okay. This is not a game. This is a virus. You are trapped. Okay. Cool. Uh, and you will have to fight for your freedom. This is like a Windows 98 reference. Prepare yourself. Prepare yourself. For if you fail, you and your computer will perish. Executing monster.exe. I win. I win. I win. I win. I, do I have to like hit his object back? Oh fuck. Oh my god! The monster's so powerful! The monster deleting my PC and turning the stream off is so powerful! I, I don't know how to- how, like, how do I kill him? Oh, I, like, blast? Oh. My fucking teeth hurt. I know that feeling all too well. I will kill the monster. I will protect my PC right at the end. I will protect my PC. I will kill the monster. Dude, the sus monster is attacking my guy. He is attacking me, dude. The monster is coming after me. Why do your teeth hurt? Too much coffee? Yeah, right. Yeah, right. Ow. Yeah, right. Like, this guy can launch the power attack at me. <sighs> uh, cool concept, but, like, this feels like the closest thing to, like, a freeware Windows 98 game that, like, pay 9.95 to get the final six levels which is just like 50 more thousand boss hp it looks like old games i respect it but like do i kill do i kill do i kill the boss i have retainers and my teeth want to die oh i see i've never had retainers thankfully like despite how fucked my teeth are <laughs> I think a lot of people have fucked teeth, unless you're just, like, super rich. Despite that, uh, like, they've remained fairly straight throughout the years. And, like, haven't chipped very much or anything. I've never had retainers. I've never needed them, I guess. But, like, I've had a few exes. One in particular, she would always tell me about her retainer. And it just sounded fucking awful. And, like, growing up, I would read the stories about, like, oh... I took my retainer out, I stopped using it for two weeks, and within those two weeks, two years of progress got reverted. I'm like, oh my god. Holy fucking shit. Oh, you have to hit the orb as he's charging it up, man. I will kill the monster. I will kill the monster. I will kill the monster with my glowing orb of power. Yeah, that does sound painful. Fuck. He's trying to get me, man. He's trying to get me, man, but I will get him. I don't, I don't think anything works here. Anyway. Anyway. Hey. Hey. I, I don't think I'm going to find anything more out of this pack. Maybe if I return again? But there's, like, porn games in here. <laughs> so, <laughs> hey, I'm just glad I got some entertainment value out of this, and I hope you did, too. For the YouTube viewers, that's going to do it. For the Twitch audience, stick around. There's more stream coming up, I promise, in a few minutes. But, uh, yeah, thank you very much for watching. And that's going to do it for a buttload of free games. Maybe I'll come back to this, but for now, uh, <laughs> hey, it was fun. All right.